Hello everyone, this is Siddharthan. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I would like to explain you about the curriculum for my hands-on machine learning course with Python that I am publishing in YouTube. Okay, so I have given the link for my YouTube channel in this uh, document file and you can get the link for this particular file in the description of this video. Okay, so first of all, let me tell you about the schedule in which I post the videos in my channel. So in a week, I will be posting three videos. So two videos will be on the course order that we are going to discuss. So those two videos will be published on Monday and Wednesday evening. Okay, and there will be one detailed video on a machine learning project and that particular video will be posted on Friday evening. Okay, so this is because I want this channel to be useful to people who are just beginning to learn machine learning so those people can watch these two videos and there are also can be people who are already familiar with the basic concepts and those people can watch this project video so that's the reason behind this okay so and what is the prerequisite for this course so I would say that the only prerequisite that I would say is that you should have some interest to learn machine learning okay so that curiosity is enough to learn machine learning and if you are new to programming that's completely fine too because i also have modules covering the basics of programming in python okay so now let me explain you the course curriculum so already we have completed two modules in my channel so you can check out the playlist in my channel so this is the curriculum so the first module is about the machine learning basic basics okay so in this module i will explain you all the basic concepts and uh, very basic terms you need to know in machine learning so there are totally five videos in this particular module so first we have discussed about the difference between artificial intelligence machine learning and deep learning then we have uh, discussed about the different types of machine learning and uh, what is meant by supervised learning and its types then unsupervised learning and its type and what is meant by deep learning okay so you can uh, check out this module and after this module we have completed the second module which is python basics for machine learning okay so in this module the first video is google collaboratory basics so google collaboratory is an environment in which you can run python codes okay so you don't need to uh, install any python ides so you can access google collaboratory through your google chrome itself so you can check out that video if you are new to python okay so then we have discussed about python basics python data types and other operators if else statements loops and functions so these two model modules are completed okay we have also completed about six machine learning projects so you can see those project topics here so first video we have seen is face recognition system then we have this rock versus mine prediction diabetes prediction house price prediction fake news prediction and this particular loan status prediction video will be published this week so it will be published on friday okay so i will be uploading more project videos every friday okay so we have completed the first two modules which are machine learning basics and python basics and we have also completed six projects in our machine learning project video playlist okay so after that the third module which will be posted from the next week is this which is python libraries tutorial for machine learning so in this module we will be discussing in detail about uh, various uh, libraries that are important for learning machine learning okay so we will be discussing in detail so these videos will be completely hands on okay so we will be doing this in python so first we will be discussing in detail about numpy library then we will discuss about various functions in pandas library then matplotlib and seaborn library and finally the important machine learning library which is the scale on library okay so these are the three modules and after completing that we will be uh, learning about data collection and data processing so in this module i will be explaining you on where to collect data and how to collect data and there is a specialized technique for collecting data through api so in that video i will explain you how to import data set through Kaggle api okay then we will be discussing how to handle missing values and other data pre-process uh, data pre-processing techniques okay so after that uh, there is another pre-processing technique called as data standardization so these are the topics in our fourth module okay so after that we will be discussing the mathematic basics for machine learning so first we will be discussing in detail about linear algebra calculus statistics and probability okay so once we are clear with this mathematical basics of machine learning so we will learn about machine learning model so in this model so we will learn the basics of what is meant by a machine learning model and where it is used and how to select a suitable model for a particular problem statement and how to optimize our model and how to evaluate our model so these concepts and these topics will be covered in the sixth module okay so in the next module it's 
we are going to discuss about all the machine learning algorithms from now on okay so this is the most requested topic in my channel okay so in this particular module we will discuss about all the classification models or else the important cl classification models in machine learning so first we will discuss about logistic regression so in the first video we will be discussing about the theory and the mathematic basics behind the logistic regression then we will build a logistic regression model from scratch using python okay so after completing the logistic regression model so we will be working on support vector machine model then decision tree classification random forest classification and naive bias classification and also k nearest neighbors so these are the models we will be discussing under classification model so you can see here i have also mentioned logistic regression because logistic regression can also be used for classification okay so these are the models that we will be covering in this classification models okay so in the next module we will be discussing about regression models in machine learning so in that we will be discussing about linear regression basics and uh, building it from scratch through python and after that lasso regression logistic regression for regression problems so the previous uh, logistic regression we have we will be discussing for classification and in this module we will be discussing it for regression problems after that we will be discussing about support vector machine particularly for regression and decision tree regression and random forest regression okay so it is uh, these two modules are for for supervised learning then we have two modules for unsupervised learning in which we will discuss about the clustering models in machine learning okay so in this we will discuss about k means clustering uh, both theory and uh, hands on video and then we will be discussing about hierarchical clustering okay so after the clustering module is over in the 10th module we will discuss about the association models in machine learning okay so there are two main association models one is a priori and the next one is eclat so these are the first 10 modules in our machine learning course so once we are done with all these modules so you can watch this machine learning projects so as i have told you earlier but i have uh, I, I have started posting the videos for this particular projects module because it would be useful for a lot of, pe of people who are already familiar with machine learning okay so this is our machine learning course curriculum so once we complete this machine learning course so we will be uh, learning about deep learning okay so deep learning this is a complete standalone course so once we complete this machine learning course i will be making a deep learning course okay so but it's so it's a topic for some other day okay so when i complete this uh, course one would require you know three months or even less than that to complete this course so i hope this could be a very good learning journey for you okay so from now on it would take almost three months also for me to complete the course okay so i will be posting videos every week okay so i have already posted about 18 videos so you can check the videos in my channel so i have given the link for my channel just i will just go to this link and show you okay So if you are already in my channel, you can get to the playlist page. So this is my channel. So here you can go to this playlist section. So here you will see this created playlist of separate uh, modules which we have discussed before. And in this section, you can see this hands on machine learning course with Python. So these are the modules we have completed. Module one, which is machine learning basics. Module two is Python basics. Okay. So this is the machine learning projects that I have told you. So the remaining eight modules will be posted regularly. Okay. So keep track of this video. So you can expect my video to be published on 5.30 PM in the evening on Wednesday sorry monday wednesday and friday okay so you can also check my machine learning project playlist so there are totally six uh, videos so far and this video this low status prediction video will be uploaded so stay tuned okay so i wish you a very good learning journey in my channel so please share this with your friends to whom you think this channel could be really helpful okay so subscribe for more videos thank you so much